Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's been a while since I uploaded a video. I actually moved to a different place, so that's why I haven't uploaded any videos. But today, as you, as you guys can tell by the title, I have a beauty haul in three different stores. But if you guys want to continue watching this video and see what I got from Sephora, Ulta, Marshalls, and a little bit of CVS, just keep on watching. So for the first store, let's do CVS since I only have two things. The first thing I have is Vaseline and it's just a lip therapy rosy lips like a chapstick. Um, I don't know. I mean Vaseline works pretty good with everything for everything so I decided to try it. Then the next thing I got was this Peripera Pang Butter Pang and it's this Oh, you can't see. So it's this lipstick which actually does hydrate your lips so good and leaves you like a pink tint. So when it dries, it still leaves your lips super pink. So yeah, but this was a little bit more on the pricier side. It was like $10, but decided to try it and I actually do like it. So I want to try more of their of this brand um more cosmetic things. Next store is Ulta and so the first thing I have is this Morphe and Jaclyn Hill um, brush and it's the JH37. It's just a regular like eyeshadow brush. The next thing is Morphe sponge. I heard so many good things about this sponge. I heard it is actually way better. I heard it's way better than the Beauty Blender so I decided to try it and it's affordable as well. And then well, when I was shopping it was actually my, birth my birthday month and on the month of August you receive a Hula Benefit. And I actually want to try this again. I did try this long time ago but I don't know why I stopped using it. It was a good bronzer. So I got my favorite mascara. It's a L'Oreal Voluminous Carbon Black um, Mascara. And this is actually a good mascara. I only have like three different type of drugstore mascara that I actually do like and they actually do work. And this is one of them. They work super good and they leave your lashes black. I got the e.l.f. 16 Arrow Camel Concealer. I really like the regular concealer. I feel like it's perfect when it's those days that I don't want to wear makeup. So I decided to try this one out. And I got it in light sand, so yeah, because I hate wearing um, foundation. The last thing I got from Ulta, and I didn't know Ulta carry Chanel. Um, I was surprised that they carry Chanel, but I decided to get the Chanel multi-use glow stick. I heard so many good things about this. I heard that is so good but i tried this already and it gives you like a natural glow it is a highlight and it gives you like this beautiful nat natural glow and the packaging is always amazing so this is the little product and you just do this and then you just blend it in with your fingers and it gives you a natural glow and i have uh marshall's um I've been so into skincare lately and all I want to do, I hit the age where I just want to take care of my skin and everywhere I go I just buy skincare products and something more natural, not something like heavy duty and those type of things. So I just want to take care of more of my skin and have a natural glow and natural makeup. For Marshalls I decided to get this Holika Holika Soothing Gel Aloe, which is a mask. So this comes with 10 sheets and is actually very affordable. It's $7.99 and it does leave your skin super smooth. The next thing I got was a Laura Mercier um, lip pencil. They have really good pro um, makeup products for a really affordable price. And I got this in the shade... It's the lip pencil in the shade Redwood. And it's more of a ready, like a red orange more like a fall color this is the color perfect for fall i'm over here trying to talk about going natural and i'm over here with red lipstick the next thing i got was green tea facial wipes um i heard green tea is really good for you and so i was like if green tea is good for you why not try green tea wipes 
Um, it does come in two pack. I already used one of. I'm using one of them. For two packets, it's like four dollars, and I think that's such a good price. And it does leave my skin not oily and not like sticky, anything like that. So this is good. It actually does remove all your makeup as well. So I have two products which I'm actually very excited to try. I already tried one of them, and it does work. So I have two products from Ole Hendrickson. And it's from the Fountain of Truth. I heard really good things. I keep hearing a lot of things. That's why I buy those this type of things. I heard this brand is really good for like skincare and all of that. So let's start with one. The big one is Fountain of Truth, the facial water, which my boyfriend says is just water, but he doesn't know. They have different types of waters. And it's orange. But such a good facial and it leaves your skin very refreshing it does smell like oranges I love the smell it just smells so good the next thing is the clean truth foaming cleanser and this is the one that I've tried and it actually I feel like it does clean my face after I do the wipes and tone my face I do the cleanser um, it says it's supposed to brighten and revive all types of skins. It cleans and removes makeup without stripping. Pretty shocked that they have Ole Hendrickson and Marshalls. And it wasn't even that expensive comparing to Sephora. And it's just like a mini, not a mini, but like a decent size. The last store is Sephora and Sephora, I love Sephora. I go for one thing and I end up buying different things I don't need. It's kind of like if you go to Target, kind of like that. But the first thing I got was the I see Shiseido Facial Cotton and they're really gentle on my skin. I usually buy the ones from Target but when I decided to try these and they're actually more gentle and they don't feel very rough when I'm removing my makeup. I will be repurchasing these facial contents. The next thing is I tried this mini because everybody and their mom is raving about the Benefit Precisely My Brow Pencil. I decided to buy the mini one to see what the buzz was all about and I haven't, I tried it on today. I'm like a 50-50. Um, I don't know. I don't know yet if I do like it. I have to give it another try and see what, how it goes. Because I do have a favorite of mine, but I decided to try that one. Then I got my favorite item, which I bought this item, travel size. And it's amazing, but the price kills me. And it's the Tasha, the water cream. This is such a good moisturizer. It leaves my skin so soft and so smooth. Especially when you exfoliate with the exfoliator from Tasha. Um, it just leaves my skin so soft and and the packaging is even cuter It reminds me of like an apple from like Snow White or something And it has its own little spoon so you don't have to put like your finger inside So yeah Then I got the Bite Beauty Agave Daytime Lip Balm I bought a, pre a lot of lip balms, I don't know why But I did a few chapsticks this is my third one from this video. Uh, um, Bite Beauty is really good. I have the the one that's with the squeezy tube and you have to like with your finger. I don't like that. So I decided to give this one a try because it's just like a little tube and you just use it like this. Which is way more easier than putting your finger in everything. And this is just a daytime lip balm. And I got the Kiehl's Midnight Recovery Concentrate and I got this in the mini size do my skincare at night I put this um, oil in my skin and then leaves it so hydrated and so like oily and fresh love this and you only use a little bit and it's still you have I still have a lot again with Ole Hendrickson I did get from Sephora, the Brightening Essential Set, which it comes with the True Serum, which everybody loves it. Then I got the Banana Bright Eye Cream, and then I got the Sea Rush Brightening Gel Cream, and 
um, I always try the mini size first and to see if I like it and if I do I buy the full product it says it's supposed to brighten and hydrate and target signs of aging we're almost done with three more products and then I did get again for my birthday month I did get the drunk elephant beauty insider um, elephant little kit which comes with the jelly cleanser and the proteiny cream then I finally decided to buy this product probably like the last one to try this but it's the herbivore jade facial roller so decided finally decided to buy this and it's just so cute it comes with this cute little this pink pouch and it's all green with the jade roller again heard that it was super good then the best thing ever existed is this Laneige lip sleeping mask and this the best thing ever um i bought this lip sleeping mask and it's a sleeping care um i obviously you put this during when you're about to go to sleep this is they should make this as a lip gloss because it's so glossy and so like shiny and oh my god it's just a beautiful thing i want to buy the other one during the daytime because it's just when you don't want to wear makeup or just like so cute and it comes with its own wand as well so you don't have to again dip your finger inside I love this um, my lips do get chapped and I highly recommend you guys try this one if you haven't the last thing I have is a dislike that I don't like and it's the you guys might disagree with me but I I don't like it for myself it's the glow recipe watermelon pink juice moisturizer it smells delicious don't get me wrong it smells amazing but when I put my moisturizer like it says it leaves my hands and my skin like very like tacky very like like sticky and I don't like the feeling that's why I decided to buy the Tatcha one because it just it's beautiful it just leaves my skin very nice then the glow recipe it doesn't I mean obviously I used it and it's empty I had to use it I had to get my money worth but and that's all that I bought mostly all skincare because again I'm trying to take care of my skin so yeah hopefully you guys do like this type of videos let me know down below if you guys do like them and don't forget to give this video a a like and don't forget to subscribe down below on the red button so you guys can stay tuned for my next videos until next time, bye!